Well, I've been shedding a little bit, but you don't really think much of it because they tell you 150 hairs a day is normal until you're washing your hair in the shower and it comes out in clumps and you're standing there crying. Uh, it's, to say the least, a bit of a shock and uh, you have to get over the horrified effect of the one thing that you might be vain about, losing it. Well, my dermatologist, bless her soul, was the one who recommended it to me, and she said it was a product she'd been reading a lot about, and uh, she said, it's, you know, there are a lot of women talking about it and a lot of articles about Viviscale now, and I should try it. So I went out, I found it, I bought it, and I started taking it. And I was taking it for about three, four months when I started to notice there was some growth coming back and uh, my hair didn't look like a bad hair day every day. Because uh, when your hair's falling out, you don't want to touch it. You don't want to brush it, you don't want to blow dry it, you don't want to wash it, you don't want to do anything to it because you're afraid everything you do is going to further that loss. Um, the growth started again, I think it grew about three inches in rapid time. And I've got to say, in two years, I have not had a split end, and I only cut my hair maybe once or twice a year. So I constantly recommend Viviscale, especially for people with uh, damaged hair. I found out about Viviscale through the recommendation of my dermatologist, um, who said that it was the one product that she'd read about, and that would definitely show a positive effect. And for the first time I saw her to the next time I saw her and her running her fingers through my hair, she said, yes, there was a definite difference in the amount of hair coming out.